myself Dr. Smita Nina Khose. I am a consultant obstetrician and gynecologist uh, working in this field with 17 years experience and I am associated with Cloud9 Hospital Kalyani Nagar, Pune. To begin with the antenatal tests, right from the date of conception, we usually um, advise ANC profile, an antenatal profile to the patient, which usually includes some basic tests such as hemogram, her urine routine and microscopy, her uh, blood group and Rh typing. Along with that, her um, you know her serology, which includes her HIV, HBCG, HCV, and VDRL, and uh, even her HP electrophoresis, her basic uh, hormones, that is her uh, you know her thyroid function test, uh, and along with that her vitamin tests, something like serum vitamin B12 and vitamin D3. So this is the basic antenatal profile which we do, and uh, definitely uh, an ultrasonography which will confirm the pregnancy of the patient. Uh, along with that, depending upon the trimester or the period of gestation, we also uh, go for something called as you know dating scans and then the uh, nuchal translucency scans which are combined with the blood test which is called as dual marker test which definitely uh, screens out the trisomies in the baby and uh, beyond that in the fifth month the anomaly scan. If the anomaly scan uh, does show any kind of um, defect in the fetal heart, then definitely of echocardiography is suggested. Uh, beyond that, in the around the 28 weeks of gestation, we usually go for an obstetric Doppler to basically uh, see the blood flow to the baby along with the growth and the lyca. And last but not the least, we also go for a 9th month scan, which is again a Doppler, uh, which you know tells us in the final position of the baby, the again the lyca status and the uh, blood flow status of the baby. Uh, so these are the various tests which we usually advise and uh, definitely all these tests are done to screen out the patients uh, basically for uh, you know preeclampsia, gestational diabetes, uh, then anemia and even of course uh, any kind of uh, genetic uh, disorders in the baby. So these are overall the broad spectrum tests which we advise.